A special sitting of the Court of Appeal taking place today to mark the opening of the legal year. Tonight, though, Fern Carey tells us that during the session, the president of the court made a very special announcement. During the special sitting of the Court of Appeal, Court President Damonita Allen announced that she will retire on December 21st of this year after spending 21 years in the judiciary. This is also Damonita Allen's fourth year as president of the Court of Appeal. She reflected on her tenure, thanking family, friends, and members of the legal community who helped to make her stint on the bench successful. She also reflected on the work of the court over the past year, crediting its performance to all of the judges who served during her tenure. Of the 1,756 matters filed between those dates, the full court has disposed of 1,227 substantive appeals. 396 applications of various kinds, including 26 applications for final leave to appeal to the Privy Council. We have written 250 <coughs> recent judgments and have given 1,373 extempore decisions. I'm extremely proud of our achievement. And as she begins her long goodbye, the Court of Appeal President renewed her call for the establishment of a Judicial Education Institute for judges. She also focused on judicial accountability, which she said is important to maintaining the public's confidence in the legal system. Inferior courts are never at liberty to depart from a previous decision of a higher court on the basis that the decision is wrong. And the practice that we have seen on far too many occasions of magistrates purporting to reduce sentences which the Court of Appeal imposed is an, is an egregious breach of this rule and only serves to bring the system into disrepute. It must not continue. Attorney General and Minister of Legal Affairs, Senator the Honorable Allison Maynard Gibson, commended Dame Anita Allen for serving with distinction. The Attorney General also encouraged judges to follow the example set by the appellate court, which he said brought systemic change in the administration of justice. You have been active in training of members of the bar, including the team at the Office of the Attorney General. We thank you for this, Madam President. Behaviors also thank you and this court for your relentless focus. Damien Allen says when she retires, she will have few regrets, having done her best to make a difference in the administration of justice in the country. Frank Gary, Seven Network News.